Russian regular forces are forming airborne assault brigades that will act as specialized units for landing and reconnaissance behind Ukrainian defense lines, according to the Institute for the Study of War. The report states that this is not a new concept for the Russian army, as similar units operated during the Soviet intervention in Afghanistan. According to Russian sources, airborne assault brigades within ground forces will be able to conduct landings in the immediate rear of Ukraine. Without parachutes, possibly using helicopter landings for rapid deployment of personnel, as was the case during the initial battles for Hostomel Airport near Kiev on February 24, 2022. IT is noted that such a unit is already operating in the Zaporizhia direction. The 49th Separate Airborne Assault Brigade is part of the 58th Combined Arms Army. The airborne assault brigades exist in the modern Russian army as part of the airborne troops, so Russian ground formations may indeed be attempting to create these formations. ISW has previously observed instances of forming reconnaissance assault brigades within general purpose formations and assessed that the creation of such specialized formations is intended to address specific tactical challenges faced by Russian forces in Ukraine. However, the deployment of airborne assault brigades separate from the broader structure of airborne troops likely signifies that these specialized brigades will be used as another means to conduct exhaustive frontal attacks led by infantry against Ukrainian fortified positions in the short term, the report states. Additionally, the report notes that a well-known Russian military blogger has complained about the unjust treatment of units comprised of conscripted personnel, as opposed to regular Russian military contract servicemen. The servicemen in the Russian Stormzy units do not fall under the jurisdiction of current Russian military legislation and, therefore, do not have the right to similar privileges as contract servicemen.